Hello everyone, uh, long time. So, I wanted to give an update on the 3D printer. I'm still working on it, but not as uh, frequent as I wanted. Um, since work, uh, um, it's a lot of work <laughs> uh, I have to do. And so this is becoming an hobby, but I'm planning many things uh, ahead. And um, I'm doing some uh, more testing on the um, induction extruder that I want to use. Anyway, here I'm going to show you what are my progress right now. So I finished the uh, X, Y, and Z axis, and then I'm, uh, right now I'm mounting uh, the motors. So here is the first uh, NEMA 23 motor, and this guy um, moves the entire Z axis. It's like a, a CNC. So if you, if you turn, it goes down. Okay, let me show you. Here. Okay, it goes down and up. So I have one motor on the axis. The uh, extruders will be mounted uh, um, here. Um, so this guy moves uh, left and right for the x-axis. I had some trouble with the, with the, these plates because they're supposed to work with this uh, 8, 80 millimeter uh, extrusion, aluminum extrusion, but in reality they don't work so well i had to buy different uh, wheels uh, from the for the bottom one and um, uh, i'm not sure if i got the right ones or or not because one worked and the other one didn't work from the same bag so i'm not sure anyway this is this is working really really well so z axis is right here x axis Right here, I mounted the motor. Right, let me show you the motor. Uh, sorry, here is the motor. Another Neman 73. I'm going to move uh, this um, entire uh, axis with uh, belts. I wanted to use uh, uh, the screws, you know, long screws for the axis but then I switch in favor of the of the belts because they're much simpler to handle um, oh we'll see maybe if if they're not capable of moving a lot of weight um, I will switch but I think it, I will be able to do it here is the uh, uh, connection for uh, the belt so from the motor here uh, go through here and then pulls up and back. I need to do a mount uh, on the other side for the belt, of course. Okay, and up here I have the sorry, I have a bunch of stuff in the middle in the way. Okay, sorry, and here is the it's a NEMA 23 for the belt, uh, and I have two of these guys. I have one here, so this is the Y axis in this direction, and the other one is down there. Okay, so these two will move the entire uh, X axis and Y axis and, and, and Z axis. Okay, so if I show you. From down here, let me put you down here, okay. So, those uh, will move uh, the entire axis back and forth, okay. The y axis, anyway. This is just the update. I'm going to do another video uh, showcasing the um, testing of the. Uh, extrusion extruder actually in the induction i have to test that before uh doing everything else um so this is a good update um a bit short but uh anyway 
So I'm going to do another video um, soon, hopefully. And um, this is the the big 3D printer that I'm building. I think it's coming along pretty well. Pretty happy about it. And um, I'll see you next video. Please leave a comment if you have any suggestions. If you think uh, I'm doing some mistakes or if uh, suggestions, I would love to hear from you guys. And I'll see you next video. Bye bye.